Hey everyone, this is Miranda from Diamond Pink with the Besties. How are you? I hope everyone is doing well. I hope you all enjoyed your long weekend. Um, yeah, it is Tuesday morning and I have a unboxing from a new to me company. Now this company um, is based out of the United States. Um, it's called Shimmering Canvas. And the way that I heard about it was I watched a video from Crafting with Shea, from Crafting with Shea and Randy, you can call me butter. And they did two different types of unboxings. Uh, Shimmering Canvas has diamond painting pens. They have special drills and they also have canvases that are legally licensed. Um, and let me tell you, the prices are really, really good. Um, so I was excited to try this. Um, so here is the plain white box. Um, I did open it from the opposite end and I'm going to pull everything out so you can see. So we have our canvas right here and it looks like, holy moly, there is a whole bunch of stuff in here. So let me get everything out so we go, oh my goodness, so we can move on. All right. So everything is out of the box. Here's our canvas and here are some add-ons. Oh my goodness. Crazy. Okay. So what did I get um, from Shimmering Canvas? So you can see real quick over the top, it's just really simple. It's just got um, their logo on here. It says Shimmering Canvas and it is in this dust bag right here. I chose um, a kit from well, you know what? I'm going to just destroy it end up having to rip, sorry for the crinkle, having to rip this plastic cover because I will never get it back, back in. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no. Technical difficulties. Here you guys play with that. Ooh, wow, this is nice. Okay, okay. Sorry, some of the um, plastic did, did get bent over during shipping, but I'm going to fix that. Wow, this is really nice. So I'm going to unroll this. Um, off camera and as you can see it's very 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 long and i will get into oh my god i'm gonna have to do a pan over on this for reels all right so toolkit i got two of them you get a boat a large piece of wax you get some thick multi-placers a pen with another multi-placer on here so i did get two that's all you need and here are my drills. I did get this in a square. And you can see it's very, very dark colors, but they do come pre-bagged. So we will go over those in a second. So um, what on earth did I get? Um, I will show you. Let me get it out of here. Because it might be easier for me to show you this way. All right. I got Bone Chariot by Jasmine Beckett Griffith. I love these panels. I mean, they are ginormous and I'll go over the size in a second. I'm just trying to get all my goodies out of here so I can show you guys everything. Okay, okay, okay. I think that goes with this. Okay, hold on, let me, let me, uh, Okay, okay, let me get let me get my life together. Let me get my life together. All right. When I flip it over, I will tell you guys what size because there is uh, no sizes on here. There are 24 colors in this. And if you do not like working out of baggies, you can make a sticker, uh, run this through a sticker maker and make it. Um, I believe that the original price is like 50 something, $57. I'll go ahead and link it below. But also I chose the upgraded package. So it was like probably 20 something dollars more, which made this kit around 80 something dollars. Um, but I'm really excited because wait till you guys see. Um, so I believe that these are all these special. I'm not sure because what else did I get? Okay, I did get a sticker sheet. Also, so I can cut these out or you may cut these out as well. Um, all right, I understand what's going on now. All right, so these are the colors that come in the kit. 
These are all the ABs that I got with the upgraded kit. I, yes. Okay, so we will go over that. This other piece of paper, and I'm showing you all this. I haven't even shown you the canvas. I'm getting there. Um, is It's got the ABs and it, next to the regular drills as well. It looks like it's giving you an option whether you would like to use the AB or just the regular drill, I believe. But we'll take a look when Lucifer came up. And it's giving you, telling you where to put the ABs, which I'm very, very excited. Um, very, very, very excited. Now, it might take me a little bit to kind of figure out what symbol on the kit it would be an AB, but I will figure it out. It's really not that big of a deal to me. Oh, I'm so sorry, Lucifer. So I'm really, really excited. So let's stop all this procrastinating and me carrying on and let's take a look at this, all right? Oh my goodness, okay. Bear with me, please. Lucifer, you're gonna get launched off. Okay, you guys. <laughs> Here she is, oh my God. And at the bottom it says, for the diamond painting attic, which I absolutely, Ooh, Lucifer, I'm sorry. So you guys, this is insane. So here is the chariot, right? Um, now, Jasmine Beckett Griffiths, she released a lot, hundreds of her images. So a lot of the companies have been taking care, uh, advantage of that to, um, you know, license her um, art to help cut down on art theft. Um, I hope it's working because it is very, very prevalent, unfortunately. So we're going to kind of just go through this as best as possible. And then I promise at the end, I will do a pan over of the complete um, kit. All right. So you can see the spooky trees in the background and the uh, dark ground below. She has her chariot with all the bones. It looks like she's got some sort of wand. Um, there is a lot of color blocking, but also a lot of confetti in here. So there is a very nice balance. Um, there's a lot of shading on her face, which will be very interesting to see. Um, oh my God, come on. Now, there's a lot of sky in here. You can see all of this background right here, a lot of sky. And then you can see the lines that holds the uh, chariot up to the balloon that is carrying her. We have a skull right here. It looks like we've got like the spine and some other parts right here. And then we get into this magnificent, this ornate detailed um, balloon or apparatus that is holding her up. The sky is getting darker, which I love. I'm loving all the blues and the dark colors in here. Um, the skulls and the intricate um, carved out areas. And then we have three skulls up at the top. Now, don't worry. There is a legend right here with a thumbnail and I will try to bring it up to show you. This is very large and yeah, so there is just that one legend on that side. So I really wish that it would, um, I'll put it down in the description what size this is. I wish on the canvas somewhere it would show you um, that what size it is. I also wish that it would have the artist's name and says that it was legally licensed. But let's take a look at what we've got going on here. Let me bring the drill field up so you can see. It's very, very clear. Here's another chariot I want too, but one thing's at a time. I'm pretty sure that this is like at least 120 centimeters in length. So we do have some color blocking confetti. And then of course there is a lot of confetti, but all the color blocking will be in the background. So it is very, very clear. So here are our drills. You guys, you can see that there is just a ton of blues and blacks and grays. The drills do look very nice. I'm seeing just flat backs on here. I'm not seeing any dimpling. But then again, you will never really know the um, quality until you start um, actually laying the drills down. Another thing that I did notice 
is that there is no kit number on the canvas, um, but there is some numbering here. But then again, it doesn't tell you really what is, what kit this goes to on the drills. It does have the DMC code though on here as well. And then it does have the number. So this is showing uh, number six for is 413. And if you do go to your legend, it is number six on here as well. So let us see what kind of special drills we got here. And I'm telling you, this is worth the money. This is so much extra. So right here, we've got... Um, and it tells you, right? So DMC 762 right here. And it says Bone Chariot. So I do believe that if you take this sheet and you go to, well, it doesn't show. So, okay, 762 is a crystal. Oh, I see. It has it separated between ABs and crystals. So that's really cool. So, um, DMC 762 is the crystal right here, and that would be number 14. It does say uh, the silver part of the chariot. So then you would have to go over to your legend, though, and find number 14, which is the letter H. So all of that would be, um, you would fill in the letter H with that crystal. Now, that does seem kind of confusing, and it might make you think, that, you know, how am I supposed to enjoy diamond painting when I have to constantly reference this chart to this bag? And, like, how am I going to know? Well, I also have, where is it, um, my, where is it? Oh, I'm just trying to get it without everything falling. Yep. I do have... Um, a drill organizer from Bella Art De Nicole. So one of the things that you could do is what I'm going to do on this is I'm going to write symbol H on here. All right. So I did write that there was this was an H. So when I am have the other 762 in here, I'm just gonna put them next to each other. So, I'm gonna show you real quick. So, let me fish out 762. Hopefully it won't take me eons to find it because these are not in, are they? Oh, they might be in order. Oh, no, no, no. Maybe not 415. They're not in order. Oh my goodness. Just hang out. Give me, give me, give me two seconds, you guys. Five, four, come on, where are you? Sorry about that. All right, so I found it. So here is 762. It's not a very big bag of it. That's what took me so long. So I'm going to put these like right together when I put it in my container. It might not just, it might not be this one because it doesn't look like it's wide enough for the bigger bag. But you guys see what I mean? I'm going to put them together like this. And that way, when it comes time for me to hit up letter H, which is actually right here in this, there's some H's in this swirl in her hair. Now, granted, that's not where it's telling me to put it, so I probably won't put it there. But when I find the H, all right, here we go. Like the H in the chariot, that's where I'm going to put it, if that makes sense. Does it make sense, you guys? I hope so. I hope so. But anyway, let us get back to what we were originally looking at, and that was all of these special drills. So 
please bear with me. You know, I'm this is a new to me company, and I really would like to make sure that I get all of this. All right, so all right, we have 762 in a crystal. We have 168 in a crystal, which is uh this says bone chariot white mocha replaces 168. So I would just find out whatever 168 is and I'll label it. Then we have um the crystal for or uh this, yeah a black crystal for as well. Then we have um this other crystal which replace uh 169 which would be The silver and the animals right here. We have this one, 159. We have a big bag of 413 right here. So this is going to be like blingy, but in a dark way. And I am definitely um, all for that. Now we have another bag right here. DMC 317, this replaces 3768, which would be the silver part or the silver in the animals. And then, this is interesting. This is 3808. 3803, I'm sorry. And it says replaces 310. And this would go on the black base. So it'd be number four. So instead of this being black right here, it's going to be these red crystals. The entire thing would be red, this, this wine kind of color crystal. That's very, very interesting. All right, now let's check out our ABs. Now, these are going to be, you know, ABs are always optional because I do see 310. Don't help Ivy, just watch, watch me struggle, dropping everything. All right, so we do have this one right here, DMC 931, which would looks like it would go in her eyes or in eyes. We have this one, 3750, and where will that one go? 37, also in eyes, so I'll have to see what that's all about. Then we have 3371. And that looks like it would go in the skeletons. We have 869. So this would replace, or this 898, which would replace 869. All right. Then we have this ooh, 842. That's really, really pretty. Where does that go? Uh, 842 would go in the bones and the skeleton and the chariot. We have, ooh, I really like this color. Uh, 3861 would replace 3872, would also go with the bones and the skeleton. 3790, same, bones and the skeleton. 823. This looks like it would go in her hair. 640. These are really generous amounts too. So 640 would be some more bones. Uh, DMC 413, which replaced 3768. Again, some eyes. And then here is 310, which is really optional. And 310, it would be in her hair. Um, I might mix this up with some regular AB, and then I think it would really, really work. Um, this isn't really giving, like, total green, but I think just mixing it up with the regular 310 would be okay. So, but like I said, I'm going to go through and label and actually put the um, symbol on here, because if not, I'm just going to be drilling away. I'm going to totally forget all about it. So this is just absolutely amazing. Hopefully I can get these all back in, how she did it. So what do you guys think? 
Um, I'm really, really impressed. I'm excited. Um, I think I'm actually going to work and finish this one before I order any more. I say that, but we'll see if any more images come out. So, yeah, you guys, this is pretty amazing. This is probably going to take me quite a bit. I also wanted to mention that this canvas is really nice. Um, it's, um, it's really soft, but it doesn't feel like a lint back, but it could be. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited about this one. You know, I finally broke down and got one of these chariots that they have. Um, but yeah, those simple minor things that would kind of help out, I would, you know, like to see in the future. But um, I'm really excited to work on this. So uh, hang out a little bit longer because don't forget, I need to do that full pan over so you guys can see it in its entirety because this would never fit in frame. So I'll be right back. Hey everyone, so I have this laid out in my kitchen floor so you can see, and I apologize for this glare, but I will try to bring it up. So this is the kit and it's in the, the canvas in its entirety. It literally takes up like almost three complete squares on my kitchen floor. Um, kind of to show you the detail a little bit better. I'll try to angle it so you can see the spooky trees. I really think this will work up quickly for the most part until we get to kind of the confetti sections right here. Looks like Neo is going to check it out as well, see what he thinks. Thank you for, Neo, do you have to walk on that baby? You can see the legends kind of smack dab in the middle of it. And he just wants to walk all over it. I guess he's giving it a seal of approval. Thank you, Neo. And then as we go up here, you can see the skulls and the ornate detail really, really well, or hopefully a lot better. But I'm loving like the clouds and the definite sky on here. And then there's Ivy. She I guess she wants to check it out as well. So overall, what do you think? I really think that I got first impression like my money's worth for sure. Um clear the cat to prove. But yeah, let me know what you guys think. Leave me some comments. Have you ever ordered from Shimmering Canvas before? What do you think? All right, you guys. Well, that is all for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, sorry if it was kind of like back and forth, but I just really wanted to make sure I explained stuff to you and gave you a really accurate description um, of how things worked. Other than that, you guys, I hope you have a fabulous rest of your day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.